February is right around the corner. Of course, it's a, a month of love and, and so much more. And the thing about it is, uh, hanging out with me, I, I can't do anything but smile when I think about just saying his name, is one of the funniest people I know. And he is coming to give us a little laughter while we celebrate love as well. Hanging out with me right now, y'all, is my brother Marcus D. Wiley. How you doing? What up? What <laughs> up, Melissa? What's happening? I, you all right? I'm good. I am really good. How are you, Marcus? I am blessed by the best. I heard a pastor say that 15 years ago. It's still relevant. <laughs> it still is. Always will be. <laughs> so, look, you know, they always say laughter is a good medicine. And everybody who knows me, I love to laugh. I really, really yeah. do. And, and you're one of the best who who uh, truly does it, Marcus? I absolutely love your Thank comedy. You. It's no no secret whatsoever. I tell you that every time I see you. But we, Thank you. we are yeah. looking forward to it. Tell us what's going on. You're coming back Valentine's Day to be exact in Fayetteville, and yeah. then the day after, which I hear is like single something. Uh, anyway, February fifth in Raleigh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. So Sunday Theater Live is bringing me down. Uh, I have a new show. It's called Marriage is Major Surgery. Uh-huh. That's the name of the show, Marriage is Major Surgery. And so uh, I'm kind of dedicating this whole year to doing shows about relationships mm. because I'm so sick and tired of all these gurus on social media and all this type of stuff. These folks be trying to talk about marriage, ain't been married. Uh-huh. Yeah. You know, yeah. ain't never been married. Now, don't, I mean, and so I, I, I be wondering how are they giving advice. And so, you know, not that I have good advice, <laughs> but I do have tenure. I have tenureship. And so. Yes, you have. How long have you been yeah. married? You've been married for a while. I've been, I've been married 25 years. Yes, congratulations. Yeah, yeah, 25 years. So, again, I'm not coming with here's how you do it. Mm-hmm. I'm just coming with some experience, <laughs> some tenureship, talking about the different stories, different things that have taken place. You know, in my relationship and some of my friends, you know, right. stuff that I throw in there. Mm-hmm. But yeah, it's just a funny show. You know, I want y'all to get your minds off uh, a marriage starting with a wedding when really it started with a surgery. Mm, that, that's what I was going to ask you. So where did you come up with the title? Marriage is major surgery. Sounds scary. Well, if you read in, if you read in Genesis, uh-oh, uh-huh. when God put man and woman together, it wasn't at a wedding. Mm, mm. He put Adam to sleep. And I know it was major surgery yeah. because anytime you need anesthesia, it's serious. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I, so I, I love the way you think. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. And so, so a lot of times people always, you know, think it started with a wedding, but no, it started with surgery mm-hmm. because I'm just reading. You know, I get to read the Bible, Melissa, from from time to time. Yeah. Every and uh, <laughs> and I notice how watch this how God named everything. He said, "Let that be." Let that be light. Yes. Let that be this. Let mm-hmm. that be that. Mm-hmm. But when it was time for him to get a woman, when it was time for man and woman to come together, he said, ooh, this is going to take a minute. This is surgery. <laughs> <laughs> I got to be surgical. <laughs> and so All right. and so, and so, I'm just going to stem from there, just letting people know, you know, get the wedding out your mind. Think more surgery. Gotcha. All right. But, but, but surgery is good for you, though, know, yeah. because it's making you whole. It's getting you better. Mm, I like it. Yeah. 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 So that's that, that's the whole theme of it without trying to give it all away. Gotcha. But all it's going to be funny. All right. February 14th, you're in Fayetteville. Um, Cape Fear Fayetteville. Regional Theater, I believe. That's where you're Yes. At? Yes. Yes. That's on Hay yeah. Street. And then February 15th, you're going to be right here in our area in Raleigh at the Museum, North Carolina Museum of Art. Yes, so people in Fayetteville, you can save your gas. I'm coming to Fayetteville. I know y'all always got to, for most, I mean, most times come to the right. RDU area, uh-huh. save your gas, come check me out in Fayetteville, and then all my folk in Riley Durham, I'll be there on February 15th. Now, where can they get their tickets? You can get your tickets at SundayTheaterLive.com. SundayTheaterLive.com. Right. Go get them tickets. It's going to be well worth it. If you're married, I promise you, you're going to get lucky that, that night after the show. If Uh-oh. you're not Uh-oh. married, uh-huh. if you're not married, then, you know, I'm going to get the ball rolling for you. 
<laughs> Y'all, it I'm is Marcus D. Wiley is coming. Marriage is major surgery. Bringing his tour right here in Fayetteville, February 14th. In Raleigh, February 15th. Get your tickets, SundayTheaterLive.com. Marcus, thanks for hanging out with us for a little bit. I appreciate you, my brother. Thank you, Melissa, for everything. All right. We'll see you on, on Valentine's Day. I'll be your host, so I'll be there with you, okay? <laughs> All right. All right. God bless. Take care. All right. All right, y'all. Keep it locked in right here. Inside the Light Lunch, more of your inspirational favorites are on the way right here on the Lights.